Well, the Henderson Police Department used to rank as one of the higher paying law enforcement agencies in the whole state. That's according to union representatives. But now the city is facing new challenges and job vacancies. 8 News Now reporter James Schaefer joins us live with more about what Henderson Police are trying to do to bring people in. James? In July of last year, the 8 News Now investigators found 46 vacant police officer positions in Henderson. Now, seven months later, they're down currently 23 more positions, a problem that is adding more pressure on the existing officers while management works to hire and train new ones. That's another reason to depart. so undermanned anyway. If this were Metro, their detectives would have been all over their patrol. Henderson police body camera video showing officers lamenting about staffing issues at the scene of a drug bust two years ago. A problem apparently at the forefront of their minds. And it's an issue that has only gotten worse for the city of Henderson Police Department. Currently, 69 police officer vacancies exist. As this city grows because of how safe it is, how much people want to want to make Henderson a place to call home, as they like to say, they need to support public safety. It's not a surprising problem to Andrew Regenbaum and Sean Thibault of the Nevada Association of Public Safety Officers, one of the largest unions in the state. The union's president saying they have requested a reopening of contracts to negotiate on wages. Starting with salary, um, because that is where we have fallen behind. Um, that's nothing that is a result of the people that you're seeing in place right now. Um, that was something that took uh, five to seven years in the, in the past administration. The issue of staffing shortages made worse by the fact that Henderson's population continues to grow every year making even the cost of working there too much for some. The officers uh, that work here can't afford to live in Henderson. They can't buy a house here. They can barely afford the rent here. Um, some of our younger, much younger officers are still living with their parents. Now, we mentioned 69 police officer vacancies as of right now. We have learned that one of those facilities operated by the city of Henderson has 19 officer openings alone, a problem the Henderson Police Union says they want to solve by negotiating with the city for increase in officer pay. Reporting from the newsroom, James Schaefer, 8 News Now.